We're in Beantown, not for a tea party, but for a battle on the home ice of America's oldest NHL team, the original six Boston Bruins. Greetings, everyone, with Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro in just a moment. This is Mike Emmerich. And we turn our attention to Game 5. From the road team's perspective, if you're their coach, what's the message? Well, let's have a good first five or ten minutes, Doc. We're going to have to weather the storm. We know the building is going to be up for grabs. The fans are going to be into it. You know the home team's going to come out and be real aggressive, try to play a physical style, try to get that first goal. But I think for my team, the road team, is that we want to make sure we can get through the first five or ten minutes even or ahead, and then we give ourselves a big chance in this game. The Blue Jackets coaching staff this morning was very confident in playing this game five on the road. They've been a good road team all season long, so they can rely on that success here in this big game tonight. Let's look at the starting netminders. He didn't get the result he wanted last time, so the playoff prize is one more game away. Let's see if he can step it up here. Off a victory last time, trying for another on the long playoff road. Matt Duchesne, one of the Canadian-born players to earn Olympic gold in Sochi. And when he broke in with the Avalanche, was on the all-rookie team. We'll hear from Ray Ferraro shortly. Eddie Olchek alongside me, Mike Emmerich. This playoff game is underway. It's a stoppage. And a startage now for Ray. No bigger games than these ones. The playoff pressure mounts. Here you are tied 2-2 in a series. You want to be the team one win away from victory. Columbus controlling play now in the defensive zone. Can start the attack going in the zone. A solo rush. He gets that squeeze in those pads and plays stop. Boston's got a face-off win. And he slides it through mid-ice. Good shooting place. Great save. That puck is held, and the whistle stops play. Critical win of the draw. Oh, the gloves are off shortly after we began play. And the fight is over with one last bombastic punch. Thought it was going to be over a little bit earlier than that, Doc. Well, the home team just rolling right over top of the visitors. The crowd is all over them right now. Over three minutes played here in the first. Neither goalie has made any mistakes so far. The Blue Jackets with a win at center. And he gains the zone propelled to Atkinson and a good save there nice face-off work trying to go to Krejci takes it in from the neutral zone turned a shot on net save Makes the stop and holds for the whistle. The man known as Bob, Sergei Bobrovsky, never drafted. He played four seasons in the Russian Hockey League before signing a free agent contract with the Philadelphia Flyers. The Bruins win the draw. Shoots one. Shot deflected. He takes that point pass. From the outside. Score!
Now that the scoring's been opened up, we'll see if the opponent can punch their way back into this game. You can't be back on your heels too long. Some shots, only one goal. A lot of opportunities. Love the mindset of getting pucks and people to the net. The Blue Jackets from the neutral zone start to work. Great chance here. Oh, that was close. That's what I would call a great A scoring chance, but the shot just missed the target. A shot. Save there. Pass comes to him from the crease. Columbus charges up from the wing. Breaks free. A good stick stop. Nice pass ahead to Chara. Too wide. Columbus is starting things up, but back deep. Oh, look at this. He's alone. Can they catch him? One on one. Score! And this one is tied. Oh, that was a critical goal. Now the game is tied, and we'll see who can get the upper hand in the next few minutes. Boston's won that faceoff and possession established. Save. Takes his pass from the goalie. Columbus is carrying it mid ice. Time of the goal. Sends to the point. Shot. Oh, terrific save on a great chance. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. And he is shooting. That's a good save in goal. They're going to have to come up with something better than that. Puck is thrown to Bjorkstrand. Canes that offensive line. Great glove save. Pass attempt to DeBrusque. Slid to Bergeron. Oh, what a save. Strong wrister. Score! Man, they're excited here. They've broken the tie. They've got the lead. But now you have to concentrate and get right back down to work. Boston's ahead by one goal here in the first period. A lot of time still left to play, but getting one and breaking the tie was huge. Boston goal scored by number 37. That puck sailed out of play and went into the third row. And a fan from Salmon Arm, British Columbia, has a souvenir. Time of the goal. 16 minutes, 37 seconds. Just under three minutes to go here in the first. We were tied, and now it's a one-goal game. In with it now. Fires, wonderful stop. Looking to Marchand. One minute left. And he shoots he one. Won. Did what he's paid to do. The Blue Jackets with a neutral zone possession along the way. And angled to Marchand. And a save. And the first frame has been completed here. Boston's got a lead of one. Stay warm and stylish at the rink with our specially priced item tonight. Our game team start priced at just $10. Hurry into our main store as supplies are limited. Bergeron's late period tally has made all the difference and will cause both coaches to say something. Intermission is here. We are in the early stages of this game, about to begin the second period. Your thoughts on the first? 
The Blue Jackets are down in this game, Doc, and rightfully so. They did not manage the puck at all. If they want to get back in that game, they got to eliminate those turnovers. First face off of period two. It's just him. Save! He scores! Matt Duchesne! Well, that certainly changes the complexion of the game. That tying goal has changed everything about this one. The Blue Jackets have even the game here. Still in the second period, anybody's game now. Boston's Blue got that one, now what? Let's it go. Made the save. Goes back deep for him. The Blue Jackets are at the wing in neutral ice. Good save. It's going to have to be something tougher than that to score. Is able to move on in. He wore that puck on a hard shot. And it's two alone on the goalie. Enormous save on a breakaway kingpin. Directing that one to Marshand. Good save there. To Duchesne. And now it's directed to Atkinson. Right in front. Terrific challenge. Outstanding save. The goaltender shuts that one down on a superb opportunity. That puck struck him in front. Columbus carrying it up the wing. A shot. Great point-blank save. Boston setting up an offense from the wing. And he fires. Routine save. Backhander to the net. Got his glove on it. And he puts the glove on it and stops play. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. Boston's quick on the draw. Scooped up by himself. Fires. Outstanding save. Difficult opportunity. That great save was all positioning. Let's it go. Has it back deep. On to Jenner. Fires. Great save. Gets a little drop off from the goalie here. Into the attacking end. Save there. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. The Bruins win it off a of body. Rister and a save. Can't get a shot on. Gotta clear it. Nash is trying to work his way to center ice. It's dumped in. Terrific determination by Dubinsky. Great stick save. The Bruins are driving it from the wing. Good place to shoot from, and he does. He hangs on and gets the whistle. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. A little over three minutes to go. Both teams have connected twice. Quick work on the faceoff. Cuts off that pass in the attacking zone. Save. Play stopped. That puck is just held. The Blue Jackets with a face-off win. 
Columbus charges up the wing. In all alone. That shot came from right in front. Great opportunity. Better stop. And it's all handled with the stick. Gets it out. To Duchesne. Duchesne's got only one goal, but that tied up the score. Shoots it on. Hit the post on the outside. Puck lifted out, and the next thing we will see are zeros. Two periods have been played, and so as we think back through the first two, we think ahead toward the third. Through two periods, an enormous number of shots on goal. It reads 21 for the Blue Jackets and 20 for the Bruins. Hey, fans, we have a car on the east lot with its lights on. Deshane's shot became his goal. It tied the game, and we head to break. He's got this one. He's got to hurry. Can he beat him here? Made that work for him in goal. Pitching it to Hyman. Skates it into the zone. Fires. Say. Chip to Marshan. Let's a shot fly. Laid on to Atkinson. It's all on his shoulders. It all along. Gathered up again by Atkinson. Very important steal for him. Crosses that line. Shoots one. May not have intended it, but it hit him. Columbus breakaway. Breaks away. Comes up big on the breakaway. Snapping a pass to Krejci. A shot. Got a piece of that one. Pitching this one to Bjorkstrand. Columbus along the wing can play it ahead. Just like shootout. Terrific grab with the glove. Lorensky's tripped up. That should be a penalty. Whistle is blown. Penalty call. Guilty party departs. Krejci's going to the box, and the call is tripping. Well, in desperation mode, all he was trying to do was sweep the puck away, but unfortunately caught the player's skates. The Blue Jackets are getting their first power play crack of the game. You can turn the tide of a game on a power play, whether you score or not, by getting shots, by getting traffic, and by keeping the puck in the offensive zone. If you chase it up and down the ice all the time, nothing gets accomplished. Drives ahead. An aggressive book check on the breakaway. He heads right for the net. A wonderful shot answered quickly. The goalie makes himself look big. Well, that's not challenging in the least. The goaltender's able to make the stop. He's got a clean line to see it. There's no challenge there. The Blue Jackets get the draw. On the outside, a shot. Got his pad on that one. May not have been intentional, but he got it anyway. Just walking the tightrope. Oh, Pocek saved one there. The Bruins shoot it. Wow, look at him. He's got a long way to go. Does he have enough gas? Swept on. Score! You knew this goal was going to be huge. This game has been tied and hard fought. The Bruins are ahead in this game by one. 
And the clock shows not that much time to go in the third period. A drop, face off one, and the winger stepped right in. Got the save there. And they've got it again. I know lots of people like high scoring. He's got this one, and they're after him. Alone. Great save, shutting down one of the best. And here again is Ray. Marshawn's always had the knack of getting his puck through from the point. The game plan is puck to the point, puck to the front of the net, everybody crash there. That's terrific, Ray, and so is he. We'll see how it goes for him here tonight. Over six minutes remaining here in the third. The Bruins lead by a goal. They just broke the tie moments ago. The Blue Jackets win it. Jones is tripped up. That should be a penalty. Shoots. Great stick there. Swept aside. The Bruins are going to the box for two minutes, and the call is tripping. He's got great stick positioning. Stick is on the ice, but unfortunately takes the skates out from under him. The Blue Jackets' power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. Good face-off win. There's not much new to a power play. It works the same way all the time. You get a good zone entry, you get the puck to the point, you shoot it, you move the penalty killers around. Let's see if they can do it this time. Now oh, this is a tough call. He was trying to play the puck, but he tripped up the attacking player. Every game presents a fork in the road opportunity, and this is it. It's a long five-on-three power play, and it begins now. One of the biggest problems on a five-on-three is teams are too cautious. They don't shoot the puck enough, and they make it too easy for the penalty killers to kill it off. Biggest chance of the game. Loud pad save. He got rid of it. The Bruins had some options there, but they made the right play by shooting it out of the zone. A solo rush. Outstanding save. We were looking for a red light there. Surprise. A huge save late in the game. Got it on his stick in the slot. Score! Outstanding job on the power play. Really like the way that they were able to work the puck on this power play. They get one to go when a power play goal has now tied this game. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. You win that, and you don't have to chase. They chase you. What a hit that was! Panarin's often the object of a target. He's so good, nobody wants to give him much room. But he gets tagged there. Brings it in for an attack. Receives that pass from the other side. Back to the point. Shoots one. Wonderful stop. In the slot. He missed the net. See if the momentum turns after that missed opportunity late in the game. A collision. I like that he's trying to create space by throwing the body around. This is a way to change momentum in a hockey game. Passing one off now to Achari. Snaps it on goal. Good save there. Moving it to Atkinson. Trying to go to Bjorkstrand. What a tremendous hit. A hit that can make you mad. Shot. Great save in close. Great display of goaltending right there, Doc. Flings it. Save! Nice hit. Anything to slow him down here. Passed across point to point. They've got all the gunners out. And a save. That one's to him from his goaltender. Puck is thrown to Bjorkstrand. Need to get rid of it. And he's tripped and there'll be a penalty. And now we'll get the penalty call. Boston sent to the box for two minutes. It's tripping. 
Oh, this is clearly a tripping call. He made no attempt to play the puck and took the legs out from the attacking player. Boston penalty to number 74, Jake DeBrus. Two minutes for tripping. Tonight is our team poster giveaway. If you find a sticker on the inside cover of your program, go to guest services to receive your team poster. Columbus has gotten the goal that has forced overtime. As you see it here, we'll take a break from you for just a moment and be back with OT. Jackets left with nothing but arrive with a power play on new ice to start the period. And it's just begun. Is it over? Collected by Duchesne. Airborne to Panarin. Terrific glove save. Pass attempt to Carlo. Skill play by Marshan. Let's it go. Great shooting lane. A big one-timer deflected off the blocker. Shoot. And the referee's whistle has stopped play. Bobrovsky's responded to the pressure here in overtime. His save keeps the game alive. The Blue Jackets with a clean win on the draw. The Bruins' power play is over at a crucial time in the game. They failed to convert, but earlier they were great. The boards are there to be used, and he does it with that pass. Stays on side to the middle. The poke check worked. Oh, what a hit. That slowed things down. Oh, I felt that hit, but heard it as well. That one came back over the blue line. Everybody has to get back, and the coach wishes he had skates on right now. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Huge hit. Shuts that offense right off. Looking to Atkinson. Gains the zone. From the slaughter wrister. Outstanding save made off a terrific chance. Directing that one to Bacchus. Pitching it to Felino. And now it's directed to Zingle. Flip to the opposite corner. Gathered up by David Backus. Snapping a pass to Johansson. Shot! Score! The overtime winner! And the players spill over the boards to celebrate. With that victory, one step from a clinch. They've broken the tie and placed themselves in a position to take it. The tie has been broken as we knew it would. The real question is, will this end in game six or seven? The pressure is on both teams to dictate how this series will go. Playoff hockey always is special. We hope this one was for you. For Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich saying good night.